Hello, my name is Aram Jung. I'm a postdoctoral fellow at University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill School of Nursing. I will be discussing our paper entitled Health-Related Quality of Life Among Non-Muscle Invasive Bladder Cancer Survivor, a Population-Based Study. My colleagues and I were interested in assessing the impact of non-muscle invasive bladder cancer and its treatment on cancer survivors' quality of life. So we decided to conduct a statewide mail survey to non-muscle invasive bladder cancer survivors who were one to six year post-diagnosis. We identified the non-muscle invasive bladder cancer population through the North Carolina Central Cancer Registry, which is a data center for all cancer patients in North Carolina. We sent out the questionnaires to 2,000 survivors and 398 survivors returned the questionnaire. Quality of life was assessed with the EORTC quality of life questionnaire and a non-muscle invasive bladder cancer specific module. From our study, we found that insomnia, fatigue, dyspnea, pain, and financial difficulty were the top five symptoms of the quality of life questionnaire domains. The lowest non-muscle invasive bladder cancer specific quality of life domain was sexual issues, including sexual function, sexual enjoyment, and sexual intimacy. Also, we were interested particularly in how survivors' sex, cancer stage, time since diagnosis, and type of treatment impacted quality of life. Our study showed one to six year non-muscle invasive bladder cancer survivors had symptoms that persisted, including urinary and bowel symptoms, sexual problems, and worries about the future. Moreover, global health status, physical, role, social functioning, and financial difficulties differed by cancer stage. And sexual quality of life differed by survivors' sex and type of treatment. Therefore, healthcare providers should regularly assess all these symptoms across the continuum of cancer care through survivors' visits, regardless of time since diagnosis, and provide appropriate care and advice by the survivors' sex, stage, and treatment. Thank you.